Antonio! What's going on everybody? It's your friendly neighborhood YouTuber back at it again with another action figure review guys. And as you can see, we have something a little bit different for you. And it is of Mario! Of course, this is the World of Nintendo. This is Super Mario. Um, I saw this at GameStop, guys. I wanted to pick him up. I'm a huge fan of Mario. I love Mario. I've been playing Mario ever since I was a wee little youngster. Um, and, uh, yeah, I had to get him, guys. I really had to get him. I got him for a good price. You know, every time I go into GameStop, I always pass up these Mario figures, but he seemed to be pretty cool. Uh, he seemed to be a pretty decent-sized Mario. And he has... Um, some nice detailing, nice weight to him, nice size Mario. Um, so I figure I'd buy him, guys. And, uh, here are all of the figures from this, I guess, wave, you could call it. Collect them all. Uh, there's Mario. I think I got this one. This is, this is Super Mario Odyssey Mario with Cappy. Super Mario Odyssey. Let's see. Is this Mario Super Mario with Cappy? Yeah, Mario with Cappy. And then there's Propeller, Mario, Koopa, Troopa, Koopa, <laughs> Luigi, and Shy Guy, Maske, Maske, Maska, Maske, Maske. And if I'm, if I'm pronouncing that wrong, I apologize. And this is series three through one. I don't know what that means. Um, let's see, 3.8 inch figure with 11 points of articulation 11 points of articulation huh what is this included inside what's that oh this hat included inside so even though i much i would have much rather got the mario with the mario hat i do like the eyes for this hat so and here's the rest of the series i definitely do have to get the luigi um yeah, I'm definitely going to, because I've seen other, I'm sure you guys have been to GameStop and you've seen the whole collection of the Marios, and they were like tiny, small little Marios, and this guy just seemed like the right size Mario, and I like the way he looked, I like the way he was packaged. So, without further ado, guys, we're going to go ahead and review this Mario with Cappy. I guess that's his name, I guess that's the name of his Cap, Cappy. I won't show you the price of how much I paid for it, even though you guys probably already saw it. And this is actually from 2008, believe it or not. This is a 2008 action figure, guys, so it just recently came out. So, without further ado, we're going to pop this guy open, and we're going to review this Mario for you. And I'll let you know if he's worth the pickup. So, let's say, put Mario right here, and let's take a look at his cap first. <laughs> uh, that is a cute cap. Of course, ho hollow kind of plastic. Not a light plastic. It's not light. But it does have a, like a little bit of weight to it, which that's a good thing. I do like this right here. I might have to keep this Mario right here. And maybe glue it to the background right over here. So uh, that's one thing I might do. I might fold this in. And then take this out. Let's take this apart. And I'm going to keep this Mario. And I'm going to put that in my background. Maybe right there. Maybe I'll super glue it right there. So, guys, without further ado, let's take out Mario and let's review him for you. Ugh. Ugh. Man, he is in there, isn't he? There we go. Okay, pretty cool, guys. He does have some pretty nice weight to him. And yeah, I can definitely check out the articulation. I really do like this Mario. He is pretty, pretty cool. Nice bend. Nice leg bend. Yeah, and that's also one of the reasons why I wanted to get this Mario is because he was a very nicely, well-detailed Mario, but he was also articulated. So some of the other Marios that you may see in GameStops or in, or in other stores, they're not... They're not articulated. They're more more or less statues. <laughs> I do like this Mario. He's pretty cute. <laughs> I do like his hat. 
Very, very cool. Now it says, oh, let me break this out right here. It says 11 points of articulation. Am I missing something here? Because really, let's count the articulation. The really thing he has, oh, I guess, well, I don't know. If you want to count that, you can walk forward, walk like that. His legs do go out. He can do the splits. Uh, he does have a knee bend. His legs do go out, so I guess would that be four points of articulation right there, being that, or maybe going forward, will that be six points? And then right here, you got maybe eight more points with his arms rotating or like this and going out. Yeah, I guess that would, that's what they're calling, and the wrist would be the ten. The ten... Well, the elbow bend and the arms going out and the wrist bend, I guess that would be 10. And then the head movement will probably be the 11th, 11th point, point of articulation. Boop. Boop. Mario just fingered you. I apologize. I apologize for that. I do like the detail of this little Mario guy. Uh, there is his little white glove, his little white gloves. Does Mario have white gloves? I never, you know, I never even paid attention to Mario's hands. I guess he does have gloves, doesn't he, guys? His little brown shoes. <laughs> it's a pretty, pretty cute little guy. Okay, so let's put his hat on his head. Let's see how well his hat goes on. Okay, yeah, that's not bad. It can go on like that. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I guess you can put it on like that. Or if you wanted to, you can put it on like that. Or maybe not. Maybe that won't fit in there. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I guess it goes on like that. Put it on sideways like so. Actually, that looks pretty cool like that. Let's see. Yeah, because he has like a little, I guess, little mohawk right here or colic or whatever you want to call it. And you just put his hat, head on one piece right there and then you can put his head on like that. And there he goes. Nothing much to, to him, just a little nice little cute little display of Mario. I definitely want to collect the, all these other action figures. You know, I definitely want to get uh, Luigi... Um, they don't have Yoshi out, so I don't know. And this is a 2008 guy, so yeah, that's pretty surprising that it's a 2008. Seldom do I find, you know, uh, video game figures that are 2008 that just recently came out, so. But I actually do like him. His hat seems a little bit too big for his head. That's only because of his hair. See, his hair is already articulated. It's not rubber, it's a plastic. So, and there's really no good way that you can really put his hat on because of this right here and this right there so that's one of the reasons why you can probably put it on like that but that uh, actually don't no, that doesn't look too bad mm. but the best way to do it is right there between that and then pop his cap on like that so overall guys he's a pretty nice figure I'm not gonna lie he's pretty pretty awesome so before I give you my rating of this Mario right here, this Mario with Cappy Nintendo, is there, let's see, who's this made by? This is made by Jax Pacific, jaxpacific.com. Not familiar with Jax Pacific, but that's the toy line. So let me put Mario down here, if I can get him to stand, and then we'll put my camera down here drop my camera down here drop my camera down below okay so there's Mario so I'm um, so guys I'm gonna bring in another uh, character that I just recently reviewed let me move this off to the side um, that I thought would measure up very well with Mario in we bring in spider ham Spider-Ham with Mario, look at that. They go very, very well together. Don't you guys think so? Spider-Ham is just a little bit little bit shorter than Mario, but they actually go very well together, and I'm actually probably going to keep these guys together and keep them displayed together like that. Spider-Ham and Mario, look at that. It's me, Mario! 
Mario. That would be awesome if you can actually play Spider Ham. You know, play play as Mario. Play Spider Ham as Mario. That's what I meant to say. Very very cool figure, guys. Let me break out the tape measure. Well, it already said what size was it? Three point eight inch figure. So let's break out the tape tape measure nonetheless. And let's measure him with the hat on. So with the hat on, yeah, he's uh, just under four inches, guys. Uh, take the hat off of him. <laughs> I don't know if I like the hat on him or off of him. So without the hat being on him, he's probably about, yeah, three and a half inches. With the hat, yeah, he's about 3.8 inches. So they didn't lie as far as that as far as height is concerned and like I said he does have a pretty nice good weight to him he's pretty heavy of course all of his weight right here is in his belly and his torso uh, his head is pretty heavy as well but it feels like well yeah yeah his head his head and his stomach area there are that's where most of the weight is coming from let's put spider ham over here let's put has put his hat on spider ham let's see how spider ham looks <laughs> Oddly enough, <laughs> it does go very well together, guys. Spider Ham wearing Mario's hat. <laughs> okay, not a bad figure, guys. So let's put his hat back on, and then I'm going to rate him for you. So there he goes. So, guys, on a scale from 1 to 10, uh, being that this is my first Mario figure... You know, I can't really compare them to anything else other than the spider ham I just showed you guys. So, on a scale from 1 to 10, guys, with 10 being the highest, I want to rate this Mario, I'm going to give him a 7. I think he deserves a solid 7, guys. He's pretty cool. I definitely like him if you like Mario, if you grew up playing Mario, Super Mario. Uh, I definitely recommend him. He's pretty awesome. He's had some pretty good articulation. He's not like the statues that you're accustomed to getting with Mario. Uh, he looks really, really nice. Awesome, awesome detailed. Not many, uh, not many uh, flaws on him. I mean, here's some like little piece of blue right here where they see the lining where they put them together. Um, little brown splot splotch right here on his pants. Uh, but overall, everything else is pretty nice. He's got like a little splotch right here on his uh, mustache, but it's not really noticeable. Overall, guys, he's a very, very nice Mario. I do recommend him. He's my first Mario review, my first Mario. And I do like him. I do look forward to collecting more of these figures and, and, and building a collection of these guys. And like I said, I got him for pretty cheap, so that's why I bought him in, to begin with. And well, that and also because I love Mario, guys. So, there he goes. There is Super Mario with Cappy. It's from 2018, believe it or not. So, guys, if you like this video, hit the like button, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button. If you want to receive more cool, awesome reviews like this. And there you guys have it. There was Super Mario with Cappy. Hope you guys liked this video. If you did, like I said, give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that notification button, guys. Focus. There you guys have it. So there you go. There's Super Mario with Cappy. And there you have it. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.